So guys, the other day I was watching this clip from the legend Arnold Schwarzenegger. I think everybody knows this man. He's been working out well before our time. And this guy, Jake Paul, don't know if you know who he is, but anyway. He asked Arnold, he says, Arnold, switch. Why do you keep working out? And Arnold said, I was working out 10 years ago. I was working out 20 years ago, 30 years ago. Why would I stop now? I'm gonna work out now, I'm gonna work out for the next 10 years. It's like eating, sleeping, breathing, guys. Let's go on our stomachs. Reach your hand up. You gotta understand, not one meal breaks you. Not one pound makes you. This is something that you need to do for the rest of your life. It could also be something that you regret. Switch as you get older. What is the opposite of taking care of yourself? Not taking care of yourself. Right now, you might be able to muscle through it. You might be able to power through your day with drinking coffee and whatever it is that you're using to keep you alive. But eventually, that fuel source is going to run out. And you're going to re heavily rely on your fitness. Reach your hand out to the side. So if you jump on the scale and you feel like everything you've done did nothing because your scale didn't move the way that you liked it, guess what? That is not the answer. That is not the solution. It is just a number. Other side. Having said that, you must have some type of starting point because there's a point where you don't want to go back to. And there's also a point where you want to get to. But this is a journey. This is a process. This is a marathon. One workout, one rep, one set, 1% 1 better every day. Bring that knee down. Bring that knee down. Why am I bringing this up, you ask? Because we are wrapping up a belly burn challenge right now. And it's always in that last kind of... 10 days where people start to fall apart. They get nervous, they get anxious. They're not happy with where they're at. And then they forget about the other 14 days, laying on your back, of where they were dedicated, where they did crazy workouts, where they tracked their food, where they meal prepped. They went to bed early, they made multiple workouts. You're telling me that one day a race is 28 days of hard work? I don't think so. Switch it up. So don't get discouraged, but also don't fall off. You can fall off, but you can't get off. And this train keeps going. Double shoulder roll. Hands up. Hands back. Clap it out, guys. Great job, home bodies. Bod squad. Get them on three. One, two, three.